the OSS handicap hurdle is next another three mile hurdle and in 0 to 140 the top one is Shaft Guard Thirsty for David Robertson Storm which Leon Van Rinsburg Bailey Plume James Shea Tamar Alco Gift for Darren Thompson Cashmere Coat Paul Rhodes Taken James Shea Occasionally Castle Hems National Heroine for Paul Rhodes Ascoli Martin Lead and Private Benjamin for Paul O'Neill Teamster Masquerade for Thomas Rogers, Better Ass Battle Ryan Costello, Elena Treat Alex Cherry, Hadaj Vinnie Gerard, Last Tale for Thomas Rogers, and Tahiti Noise for Alex Cherry. So 16 of them then. Short run to the first, and over it they go. These hills look a little bit bigger than the ones we've seen earlier today. And they're all over the first, it's a short run to the second. And over that one they go as well. 17 to take this time. Our last race was a three mile hurdle, I think they only took 12. So more emphasis on the jumping in this one as they skip over a third already and Bailey Plume just about the leader the Tahiti noise on the inside last tail and taken better ass battle up there as well so to ask goalie as they sort of try and sort themselves out nothing seems overly keen to lead the Tahiti noise it looks like he's going to take it on sufferance so although Alex Cherry does have a few front runners usually and that one leads by a length to Bailey Plume in second, taken his third. Then last tail and better ass battle in the pale jacket. The orange on the outside is Ascoli, the national heroine, Storm Witch, but they're pretty tightly packed. In the main body of the field, Hadaj, just a back marker with the grey, occasionally Castle, also towards the rear, but Tahiti Noise is the one in front. That leads by a couple to Bailey Plume, and then national heroine, as they get to the fourth. All safely over that one. All hurdling well. See that many fallers in the hurdle races today. I say take the fifth. Ah, a bit of a mistake there by the grey. Occasionally Castle has seen that one shuffled to the back. Past the winning post then. I'm going to come round twice more yet. And Tahiti Noise is the leader. From taken in second. Bailey Plume is third. Storm Witch in the Dark blue moving up on the rail in fourth. Then Private Benjamin in the red and green, the pale jacket of National Heroine. And the white jacket with a black cap of Better Ass Battle is also towards the, the four. You can tell the pace isn't all that hot because the grey occasionally castling made a bit of a mistake and dropped it to last. is now right back up in contention on the rail as they take the sixth. All over that one, okay. Tamanarco Gift, the new back marker, but there. Bunched up like six furlong sprinters as they take the seventh. And they're all over that one okay as well. With Tahiti noise continuing to show the way. Over number eight they go. A slow jump on the outside by Ascoli. I see that one. The latest horse to occupy the back spot as they take the ninth. All over that one now. It's Cashmere Coat has been shuffled to the back. So plenty of changes at the back, but no change up front. Tahiti noise continues to quietly take them along and occasionally castle the grows move right through into second then taking the last tail and shaft gun thirsty Ascoli another one who's moved back up again and storm witch national area Bailey plume had edge but you can see they're still really tightly grouped with the exception of this leader who's got a four length lead from the grey occasionally castle just second then taken and private benjamin then Alina Troop, the stable companion of the leader. Ascoli is also moving up again now. Tamanarco, Gift and Cashmere Coat, the current back markers. But Tahiti Noise comes down to the next flight. This is flight number 10. It's over it nicely. They're all safely over that one with Ascoli now second. Alina Troop third. Last tail four. Private Benjamin five. Occasionally Castle six. And then Shafgan Thirsty and Better Us Battlers. They take number 11. All over that one okay as well. It's a heaty noise still in front past the stand again they go past the winning post one more circuit to go and a heaty noise is in the lead from Alina Treat second better ass battle is third towards the back Tamanarco gift and teams to masquerade towards the back but they're no more than 10 lengths off the lead so this is still a wide open race and Alex Cherry's got a 1-2 at the moment with Tahiti Noise 
on the inside and Alina Trude on the outside. Last tail coming between them. Then Storm Witch taken. Shafgan Thirst is there. Then Bedras Battle and Bailey Plume as they take the 12th. And they're also feeling over that one as well. With Last Tail now going to challenge for the lead. It's Tahiti Noise and Last Tail. Over the 13th they go. But the Alex Cherry pair have gone back into the front two spots again. Tahiti Noise on the inside. Alina Trude on the outside. Coming between them now is taken. Then Hadad and Storm Witch. Bailey Plume and Last Tail occasionally Castle. Ascoli, Tamanaco, Gift and National Hero trying to get into it. Better Us Battle is still there as they take the 15th. They've only got two more to take now then. And it's still Tahiti Noise in the lead. On the inside, occasionally Castle's come back through in the second. Taking his third. Then comes Tamanaco, Gift come with an interesting looking run. Also Shafgan Thirsty trying to track that one. Alina Troops lost its place a little bit. Teams to Masquerade trying to get into it as well. But it's still Tahiti Noise. Tahiti Noise still in the lead from occasionally Castle. And Tamanaco, Gift. They've only got three furlongs to race. They've only got two more flights to take. And it's Tahiti Noise on the inside. Now being strongly pressed by Tom and Arco Gift. And occasionally Castle between the two. Then Taken is back in fourth with Bailey Plume fifth. Then Shafgan Thurston and Storm, which Hadaj, National Heroine and Alina Troop with Teams to Masquerade. And then Ascoli. I think we can forget anything after that. It's occasionally Castle hits the front. Occasionally Castle runs in the lead. But Tahiti Noise is trying to fight back. Tamanaco Gift and Storm, which throw down big challenges as well. But then Grey occasionally Castle is racing to the final flight. Gets over it nicely. Tamanaco Gift and Storm, which and Bailey Plume are trying to close. But then Grey occasionally Castle is racing up towards one and take it. Okay. Castle wins it, Storm which is second. National Heroine finished really well. And there's Better Ass Battle at the back. And a short running, plenty of jumping. And occasionally Castle made that one mistake early on, but certainly made up for it for the rest of the race. It's a good win. Let's get a full look at the list of connections. It's occasionally Castle the winner for Hems, Storm Witch for Leon Van Rensburg second, Tamanaco Gift for Darren Thompson was third, Bailey Plume James Shea fourth, and National Heroine for Paul Rhodes was fifth.